So welcome to Brett Ridgeway's Learning for Life video lessons where you are going to be in double C tuning and learning a Christmas carol called I Saw Three Ships. And before we begin, I do want to thank my patrons uh, for making these lessons possible. You know, I thank them every week and I don't want them or anyone to think that I'm just doing that. You know, so, so very many people are benefiting from these lessons and learning from these lessons. And yet that is because of those who are giving back and helping to make these lessons possible. So I do want to thank them and let them know how much they are appreciated. So this is a very, very easy tune, probably one of the easiest tunes that I have taught on here. So so really what I'm doing, uh, the first time I played it through, I just really played the the basic melody with hesitations. And then the second time I did a little bit of drop thumb. But, but this tune, even with just the hesitations, sounds very nice. So what we're doing is we're playing the third string open, second string, second string, and then the first string. So strings, three, two, two, one. The only thing I did there different is I put a hesitation in. So hesitation, hesitation. Then you're going to put your pointer finger down on the first string, second fret, play that note, and then slide that from two to five with a hesitation. Then back down to two, then open with a hesitation. Again. Then three, two, second string twice. Three, two. Now you're going to go back to that first string at the second fret. So if you notice, I didn't lift this off. I left this finger down the entire time. You don't want to move your fingers unless you need to move your fingers. So three, two on the first string, hesitation, second string twice, hesitation, and then that first string still fretted at the second fret. Lift it off, third string twice, again. If I didn't do the hesitations, it's just going to sound like this. And if I didn't slide, I did was put in some of the hesitations. Now, I would make sure that much is memorized. And we're going to keep going and then we'll come back and add a little bit more to it. So it starts over. Which is simply a repeat of what we just did. Then we're going to simply have a different ending, 
uh, three, two. So three, two, hesitation, second string open twice. And then the first string open, two, first string open, again, so, sorry, again. So again, it's not a hard song at all. Very short lesson, actually, because the song is so easy. Let me play it from the very beginning. If you want to put a little drop thumb in there, sorry, right there, which is a double thumb, So I hope you enjoyed that. It's a very easy song to play. And again, it sounds very nice. Kind of, you can play that rather upbeat. Or you can play it slow and pretty. But again, I, I th hopefully this kind of a song will really get you going and encourage you and and again, it's just an easy song to do. And uh, actually, to me, it sounds very, very nice. So I hope you enjoyed that lesson. Not, not a long one, but not, not needing to be a long one. Uh, you know, one of the things I try to do when I teach is not just try to teach someone how to play the claw hammer banjo or bluegrass banjo or dulcimer or any other instrument, but to do it where it's easy for them to learn how to do it, to really break it down and make it simple for them. So I hope, I really do hope that you've... Uh, you're enjoying these lessons and thank you so much for watching. Please share and help get the word out about these uh, lesson program. Thanks so much. We'll talk to you soon.